So starting uh, starting with this question, he's saying that there is an aqueous solution uh, where uh, it contains one mole of silver nitrate and one mole of FeSO4. So first thing is uh, this silver nitrate, remember, has uh, silver ions. Okay, so it's got it's got silver ions, and this other thing, FeSO4, has Fe plus two ions. So when he says that one mole is there and one mole of this, so that means uh, initial moles. We know the initial moles. Okay, initially, how many moles were added? One mole of this and one mole of this. That is given in the question. Okay, one mole of this, one mole of this. So that's given. So those are your those are your initial moles. And he did not add any of this. So zero moles of this and zero moles of of this. So that's the first thing. And then he says, okay, the reaction must have started. The reaction must have gone in the forward direction or backward direction. And equilibrium must have been established. Or jab wo equilibrium established by now, what happened was uh, there was 0 0.44 moles of silver ions. So at equilibrium, you had 0.44. So you had 0 0.44 moles of silver ions, right? So what that means is, okay, if you had one mole initially and now you have 0 0.44 moles, so what does that suggest? Where did the 0.56 go? The 0.56 must have, they must have reacted. Is that clear? So they must have reacted, right? So, yes. Said, so, so you started off with one mole. Now you have 0 0.44 moles. That means 0 0.56 must have, they must have reacted. So uh, if they have reacted, so what did they react with? It's one ratio one, right? So that means uh, if 0.56 of this reacts, 0.56 of this would also would also react, right? One mole, you started with one mole, 0, 0.56 have reacted, so you're left with how many moles? 0. 0.44 moles. Is that clear? And just hold on yes. a second. Just hold on one second. So, Saga continue Karthik, okay, 0.56 reacts with 0.56. So, how much of AG would be produced? 0 0.56, right? It's 1 ratio 1. But this is produced, right? And 0 0.1 ratio 1 to so this one, 0.56 must be produced. So, your equilibrium moles are going to be for AG and FE. There were no moles. Now, 0 0.56 extra have been produced of both of them. Is that clear? That these are your equilibrium moles. You clear this, Haruko? Uh, yes, sir. Yes. Acha, baki wo ke KC expression. Can you tell me what the expression for KC is in this case? It's product concentration divided by reactant concentration, right? So it's going to be product concentration. So it's going to be 0.56 into 0.56. divided by the uh, reactant uh, concentration, which is 0.44. Was a one DM cube container? He told us that it was a one DM cube container. So make sure you calculate concentration. Uh, one DM cube makes it easy. The concentration would be exactly the same. So it's going to be 0.44 divided by 0.44. I said, I made a KC expression in a wrong way. What is that mistake? Okay, what did I do wrong over here? Anyone, Mahin, any idea? Mikal, Hamza, anyone? Uh, Koi idea, what, what went wrong over here? Okay. I had told you previously when we were studying this, I told you that concentration is a term that only applies to what? It only applies to either solutions. Uh, you use solid. Huh. Or you use it for gases. I mean, usually you don't even use for gases, but mostly it's used for solutions. Uh, but there is a solid. Or solid ka ka bada hai tha. Solid ki concentration jo na, that is going to be taken as one. one. Okay. Its concentration is constant. 
सो वो एक पॉइंट फाइव सिक्स जो है ना दैट वुड बी रिप्लेस बाय बेसिकली वन ये हमने डिस्कस किया था कि आई टोल्ड यू दैट अ सॉलिड इट्स कॉन्सेंट्रेशन डज नॉट चेंज तो ये आपका एक्सप्रेशन होगा एंड दिस अब इसको कैलकुलेट कर लो क्या क्या आंसर आ रहा है Two point eight nine. So this is coming out to be. Are you, are you sure it's point four four? Okay. I thought it was one point six two, but I'm I'm not sure. So this guy, whoever answered, that's two point eight nine. Okay. Now, now the next one is. Uh, so remember, uh, that's that's your KC question. The other thing is you have. Uh, There's only one thing that changes the value of Kc and Kp, and that is temperature. Otherwise, it's a constant. Okay, so temperature is our answer. Okay, you'll get you'll get a lot of these questions. So make sure you remember this Kc and Kp values. It does not change when you add a catalyst. It does not change whether you change the concentration or pressure or anything. Kc is a constant, or Kp is a constant. All of these. Sir. Ani. How does increasing concentration can increase the rate of reaction? नहीं rate वाला कौन सा question है यहाँ पे वैसे पूछो के वैसे पूछो नहीं नहीं concentration क्या है कि वो वो rate हम go through कर लेंगे concentration आप बढ़ाओगे तो क्या होगा collisions क्या हो जाएंगी particles के बीच में ज़्यादा हो जाएंगे तो बस ठीक है तो ज़्यादा reaction होगा फिर ठीक है कंसंट्रेशन कम होगी तो क्या होगा मतलब अगर पार्टिकल्स कम होंगे दे वुड बी फार अपार्ट तो रिएक्शन ऑब्वियसली कम होगा वो एक दूसरे को मिस कर रहे होंगे दे वुड बी एबल टू कोलाइड विद ईच अदर ठीक है ओके सो नेक्स्ट वन एक्स दिस इज ही इज आस्किंग फॉर द यूनिट्स ऑफ ऑफ केसी तो यूनिट्स ऑफ केसी क्या होगा इट्स गोइंग टू बी पहले तो केसी का एक्सप्रेशन इट्स गोइंग टू बी प्रोडक्ट कंसंट्रेशन y स्क्वायर्ड Uh, divide by z uh, cubed. ठीक है. Remember the coefficient becomes the power. Divide by the reactants. Reactants in this case is W into W concentration into the concentration of X, and that's going to be squared. The concentration का unit क्या होता है? That's mole per dm cube. I told you to take it as X. So it's it's X squared into X cubed divided by what? Uh, divided by X into X squared to X squared. तो ये पार्ट जो है कैंसिल आउट हो जाएगा यू लेफ्ट विद एक्स स्क्वायर एंड व्हाट वाज एक्स एक्स वाज कंसंट्रेशन राइट एक्स वाज कंसंट्रेशन सो मोल पर डीएम क्यूब स्क्वायर्ड सो इट्स गोइंग टू बी मोल पर डीएम क्यूब मोल पर डीएम क्यूब एंड दैट्स गोइंग टू बी स्क्वायर्ड ठीक है दैट्स गोइंग टू बी आर आर यूनिट एंड कौन सा बनेगा दैट्स गोइंग टू बी मोल स्क्वायर डीएम माइनस 6 दैट्स दैट्स गोइंग टू बी बी Say next one. A uh, very similar question. K. Uh, I said this is now the exact opposite. Okay, I'm not sure if he did this, but but you get two types of questions. One is, I mean, both questions are going to be solved in this way. This next one would also be solved in exactly the same way, except that there is a trick. That is that Kc is already given, so you're not calculating Kc. The value of Kc is sixty. They've already told us. So if I do the working here, it's H two plus I two in equilibrium with two H I. Okay. In this case, what is happening is that they've given us the number of moles of H I in equilibrium with. He's saying, what is the number of moles of H I in equilibrium with two moles of H two and? Okay. So they've now this question is easy. They've already given us the equilibrium moles. He's saying, "What is the? I mean, he's saying, 'What is the moles of H I in equilibrium?' So these are the ones that we are looking for, which are in equilibrium, equilibrium with two moles of hydrogen and 0.3 moles of iodine. So two moles of hydrogen and three moles of of iodine. So you just write the KC expression. The KC expression is uh, H I squared. So we don't know what this question mark is. So I'm going to take that." As x, okay. So I'm going to take that as x. It's going to be x squared, and it's going to be divided by what? Two uh, into into three. 
ठीक है एच एस स्क्वाड डिवाइड बाई एच टू एंड आई टू और केसी की वैल्यू आपको पहले ही पता था केवन एस वॉट इट्स केवन एस सिक्सटी तो सिक्सटी इंटू सिक्स आई थिंक बिकम्स वॉट ये मैंने सही लिया टू मोल्स थ्री मोल्स ठीक है सो दैट इज एक्स स्क्वाड ये तो सही है एंड एक्स स्क्वाड कम्स आउट टू बी वॉट सिक्सटी टाइम्स सिक्स फिर अंडर रूट करना पड़ेगा कि व्हाट डू गेट व्हेन यू अंडर रूट दिस एटीन पॉइंट नाइन व्हिच इज नॉट एन आंसर आई मीन व्हाट व्हाट मिस्टेक डिड वी मेक द इक्वेशन वाज रिटन करेक्टली इट वाज गिवन एस सिक्सटी Actually, the question the question is the question is fine. What is the total number of moles of H I in equilibrium with two moles of? That's a point three. Yes, so I I made this mistake. Okay, the error is it's not three moles. It's point three. The error. Okay, just avoid silly mistakes like these. Okay, zero point three. So this is zero point three. Ab iska karo kids. What do you get for this? Six. Okay, now so this is zero point. Okay, now this is zero point uh, three, or then, I mean, we will try to correct it. So, just a second. Okay, now it's six. ठीक है नाउ इट्स कमिंग आउट टू बी इट्स कमिंग आउट टू बी सिक्स जस्ट होल्ड ऑन सेकेंड इसको दोबारा ऑन करना पड़ेगा वन सेकेंड अच्छा नेक्स्ट वन अगेन इट्स द यूनिट्स ऑफ केसी व्हाट आर द यूनिट्स ऑफ केसी सो इट्स गोइंग टू बी प्रोडक्ट कंसंट्रेशन डिवाइड बाय रिएक्टेंट कंसंट्रेशन सो इट्स गोइंग टू बी केसी इज इक्वल टू Uh, C2H2 and H2 would be cubed and divided by CH4 and that's going to be squared. So its concentration would be taken as x. So it's going to be x into x cubed and divided by x squared. तो क्या बना इट्स इट्स गोइंग टू बी एक्स स्क्वायर राइट एंड दैट्स मोल टू डीएम माइनस एक्स मोल पर डीएम क्यूब स्क्वायर ठीक है एक्स इस मोल पर डीएम क्यूब सो इट्स मोल पर डीएम क्यूब इनटू मोल पर डीएम क्यूब डिवाइड बाय मोल पर डीएम क्यूब स्क्वायर ये क्लियर है ये वाला यस सर यस सर अच्छा फिर ये वाला क्वेश्चन यू Really difficult question. We'll do it right at the end, the way they mix it up with moles. I said, now this one. I've got. One second, then I board hangover. I said, now this one. You've got uh, a mixture of one mole of. So the bara, its uh, initial moles are given. So it's N two plus. Uh, 3 H2 and an equilibrium with 2 NH3. Yoga. I say initial first row initial. So what are your initial moles? The initial moles that are given are one mole of this, three moles of H2. So one mole of this, and you've got three moles of this. Or ammonia we beach mein dala hai, and there is 1.98 moles of. Ammonia, so you've got that as well. So one point nine eight moles of this. Abu kare ke it's allowed to reach equilibrium and at equilibrium, ठीक है? It reaches equilibrium in a sealed vessel under certain conditions, and it was found that one point six four moles of nitrogen were present. ठीक है तो अच्छा क्या? It was found out that one point Six four moles of nitrogen were present. 
तो इक्विलिब्रियम के ऊपर 1.64 मोल्स पड़े हुए हैं एंड दोज आर योर इक्विलिब्रियम और ये इक्विलिब्रियम के मोल्स हैं सो व्हाट डज दैट मीन इट मींस के इट मींस के वो ज्यादा हो गए 1.64 आर पर और वो एक्स्ट्रा आ गए ठीक है तो इसका मतलब है रिएक्शन जो है वो किस डायरेक्शन में जा रहा है रिएक्शन जो है ना दैट इक्विलिब्रियम हैज बीन फॉर्मड आई मीन देयर वुड बी सम बैकवर्ड रिएक्शन 0.64 एक्स्ट्रा आ गए ठीक है प्रोड्यूस हुए राइट तो अगर इसके 0.64 प्रोड्यूस हुए तो n2 के और रिमेंबर रेशियो इधर बीच वाले पे अप्लाई करना है रेशियो डज नॉट अप्लाई टू द इनिशियल मोल्स इट क्योंकि इनिशियली यू कैन ऐड एनी नंबर ऑफ मोल्स यू लाइक रेशियो इसके ऊपर अप्लाई होगा दिस इज द अमाउंट दैट इज बीइंग प्रोड्यूस 0.64 तो इसके कितने होंगे 0.64 टाइम्स 3 होगा राइट इज दैट क्लियर या 1.92 यस अच्छा फिर उधर तो ये भी ऐड हो गए ठीक है क्योंकि प्रोड्यूस हो रहे हैं और उधर फिर रिएक्ट हो रहे होंगे पॉइंट वन रेशियो टू है ना तो पॉइंट सिक्स फोर इंटू टू वुड हैव रिएक्टेड तो वो माइनस होंगे बिकॉज दे हैव रिएक्टेड राइट इज दैट क्लियर यस ठीक है जस्ट मेक श्योर के रेशियो वुड बी अप्लाइड ऑन दिस थिंग व्हाट इज गेटिंग रिएक्टेड व्हाट इज गेटिंग प्रोड्यूस्ड सो हाउ मेनी मोल्स इन टोटल डू यू हैव एट इक्विबियम थ्री पहले थे एंड नाउ यू हैव गॉट पॉइंट सिक्स फोर इंटू थ्री एक्स्ट्रा सो दैट्स फोर पॉइंट वॉट नाइन टू 1.92 किस किस के सही है 4.92 क्या हां इसके कहते हैं 1.92 यू स्टार्टेड ऑफ विद 1.92 नाउ 0.64 इनटू 0.7 आई शो 0.7 है जी जी सर चलो ठीक है 0.7 सो इट्स गोइंग टू बी सो इट्स गोइंग टू बी आई थिंक ए आई मीन द एक्सप्रेशन इज गोइंग टू बी ए इट्स गोइंग टू बी nst स्क्वायर 0.7 स्क्वायर डिवाइड बाय 4.92 और Uh, 1.64 as well. ठीक है, is that clear? Yes. Sir. अच्छा. Yes. Sir. Now this particular question ha- actually has an issue as well, and that is that remember, be careful. You don't use moles in the KC expression. अच्छा, एक second रुक ना, पता नहीं क्या होगा ना वहाँ पे. अच्छा, so अच्छा सो सो द पॉइंट इज यू डोंट सेकेंड जो इसके साथ ही गुजारा करो पता नहीं क्या चीज है Okay, so coming back to this, I said there's there's something wrong with this question, and that is that you don't use moles in the KC expression. You use concentration. Moles sirf kab use karne when the when the units cancel out. So they didn't give you the volume in this case. मतलब यहाँ पे ना moles use you should not have used moles. So there's something wrong with this specific question. अगला question भी exactly same है, so it's kind of the same. Uh, लेकिन इसके अंदर ना they've given us the volume. तो ये मतलब दिस इज दिस इज काइंड ऑफ पिछले के अंदर ना वॉल्यूम देना भूल गए मेरे ख्याल से तो रिमेंबर 4 डीएम क्यूब कहां पे दिया हुआ था पिछले में नो सर नहीं पिछले में नहीं दिया हुआ ना उन्होंने ठीक है ओके तो ये एग्जैक्टली सेम क्वेश्चन है बट इन दिस केस दे गिवन अस द वॉल्यूम ठीक है सो रिमेंबर डोंट मेक दिस मिस्टेक मोल्स डायरेक्टली यूज नहीं करने के सी एक्सप्रेशन में यू हैव टू कैलकुलेट कंसंट्रेशन ठीक है बट इन मोस्ट केसेस दे विल गिव द वॉल्यूम वन डीएम क्यूब सो मोल्स एंड कंसंट्रेशन वुड बी काइंड ऑफ द सेम थिंग इसको जल्दी से कर लेते हैं n2 एंड h2 इट्स काइंड ऑफ द इट्स काइंड ऑफ द सेम रिएक्शन बट विद डिफरेंट डेटा तो अच्छा क्या दिया हुआ आपको इट्स गिवन यू गिवन टू मोल्स ऑफ दिस इनिशियली और इसको यू हैव टू मतलब यू हैव टू डू इट क्विकली ठीक है सिक्स मोल्स ऑफ दिस एंड यू आर गिवन 2.4 मोल्स ऑफ अमोनिया दीस आर इनिशियली मिक्स्ड मैं वो हेडिंग्स भी नहीं लिखूंगा बिकॉज़ इट्स जस्ट रफ वर्किंग ठीक है तो इट इज फाउंड दैट 2.3 वर प्रेजेंट इन इक्विलिब्रियम सो इक्विलिब्रियम के ऊपर 2.32 नाइट्रोजन्स है 
मोल्स हैं तो बाकियों के बताओ कितने होंगे तो हाउ मच एन टू गॉट प्रोड्यूस्ड ठीक है वो मतलब प्रोड्यूस हुआ है तो इसका मतलब है कि एच टू कितना प्रोड्यूस हुआ होगा वन रेशो थ्री सो दैट्स गोइंग टू बी जीरो और वो कितना रिएक्ट हुआ होगा वन रेशो टू सो पॉइंट सी टू जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स पॉइंट सिक्स फोर ठीक है वो माइनस होगा बिकॉज इट हैज रिएक्टेड ठीक है तो इधर कितना होगा सिक्स पॉइंट नाइन सिक्स राइट टोटल क्योंकि सिक्स तो पहले ही थे एंड जीरो करना तो वो इस केस में तो फायदा कोई नहीं है वो वही आएगा आंसर ठीक है लेकिन मतलब दिस इज एन इम्पोर्टेंट स्टेप क्योंकि अगर वॉल्यूम वॉज टू डीएम क्यूब यू वुड आई मीन दी वैल्यू वुड बी डिफरेंट ठीक है विच इज वाई आई एम सींग दिस क्वेश्चन इज रॉन्ग एक्चुअली मतलब उन्होंने दिया हुआ भी होगा उसके अंदर एग्जाम रिपोर्ट में मिस्टेक है आई मीन Remember, K C expression. Me, the only time you use, I mean, you always input concentration. The only time you are allowed to use moles is when numerator and denominator me terms are not equal. Meaning, the unit cancels out. So, if you divide by volume, while a part, na, it's it's not important because it's going to get cancelled out. So, ha, but who are you? Huh? Unit. So, first, first we have to do the unit thing, then solve question. नहीं यूनिट का वो इजीली पता लग जाएगा आप इस साइड पे मोल्स काउंट करो कितने हैं टू है मतलब देख के पता लग जाएगा यूनिट निकालने की जरूरत नहीं है इस साइड पे मोल्स काउंट करो कितने हैं दैट्स फोर राइट तो तो वो यूनिट कैंसिल आउट नहीं होगा इस केस में क्योंकि न्यूमिनेटर में दो टर्म्स हैं और डिनोमिनेटर में फोर टर्म्स है ना यस तो आप मोल्स काउंट कर लो जब इक्वेशन में ना मोल्स दोनों साइडों पे इक्वल होंगे ना दैट्स व्हेन द यूनिट कैंसिल आउट सही है। ओके। अच्छा ये ली शार्टलर प्रिंसिपल इज दे क्रूब एम इज गोइंग टू ट्राई एंड अपोज एनी चेंज दैट्स दैट्स इंट्रोड्यूस्ड टू द सिस्टम। और फिर वो कह रहा है फ्रॉम योर अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ ली शार्टलर प्रिंसिपल स्टेट द कंडीशंस ऑफ टेंपरेचर दैट कुड बी यूज्ड इन ऑर्डर टू प्रोड्यूस एन इंक्रीज्ड यील्ड ऑफ मेथेनॉल। यील्ड आउटपुट ज्यादा होनी चाहिए मेथेनॉल की। फॉरवर्ड रिएक्शन। सो Lower temperature, higher temperature. If I want more methanol, high temperature. Now, if first of all, forward reaction is it exo or is it endo? Exo. 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 So exo, kis pe hota tha? Lower temperature, higher temperature. Rule kya tha? Lower temperature. Lower temperature favors exothermic reaction. Higher temperature favors endothermic reaction. So lower temperature. फिर वो प्रेशर का भी कह रहा है और एक्सप्लेनेशन क्या होगी कि इट्स मतलब एक्सप्लेनेशन वही होगी कि इट्स एक्सोथर्मिक दैट्स द एक्सप्लेनेशन ठीक है अह फिर वो प्रेशर का कह रहा है हाई प्रेशर और लो प्रेशर बिकॉज़ आई वांट टू सेंड इट इन द फॉरवर्ड डायरेक्शन सो क्या होगा हाई प्रेशर और लो प्रेशर लो प्रेशर नहीं इधर कितने मोल हां क्योंकि हाई प्रेशर का हाई प्रेशर का क्या होता था कि हाई हाई प्रेशर Favors the less gas mole side because high pressure pe na you're compressing, compressing it. So high pressure pe less gas moles side is favored, right? Clear? Yes, sir. Got it. So less gas mole side jo na back side pe na three moles hai or forward me na there is one mole. So obviously it's going to be uh, high pressure because okay, less less gas favor hogi, theek hai? तो ये उसकी एक्सप्लेनेशन है कि हाई प्रेशर वुड बी यूज बिकॉज द लेस गैसमोल साइड इज फेवर्ड व्हिच इज द प्रोडक्ट साइड ठीक है तो हमारा वो किधर गया अच्छा अब ये वाला क्वेश्चन पता नहीं लास्ट क्लास में मैंने ये कराया था कि नहीं कराया था लेकिन इट्स एग्जैक्टली द सेम टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन कि इनिशियल मोल्स गिवन है हां 
we have not done type two questions. चलो ये ये वो type two है second time. हाँ ठीक है ये second type है. Question वही है मतलब there's no difference ठीक है the technique is exactly it's exactly the same ठीक है. तो बस फर्क ये कि the KC value has already been given. It's given as so you're not calculating KC. The KC is already with you. It's given as one point four four ठीक है. अच्छा make sure be careful कि केसी की वैल्यू जो ना वो टेम्परेचर के साथ चेंज होती है सो रिमेम्बर दिस केसी इज कॉन्स्टेंट अदरवाइज बट इट चेंजेस विद टेम्परेचर तो मेक श्योर अच्छा सो सो मेक श्योर कि वो जो टेम्परेचर कह रहे हैं ना कि इस टेम्परेचर पे कैलकुलेट करो तो आर यू यूजिंग द करेक्ट केस समटाइम्स इन क्वेश्चंस दे विल गिव यू मल्टीपल केसी वैल्यूज एट डिफरेंट टेम्परेचर्स तो जिस टेम्परेचर की वो बात कर रहे हैं मेक श्योर ये वही वाला केसी है कि नहीं क्योंकि केसी इज गोइंग टू वेरी विद टेम्परेचर ठीक है सो मेक श्योर यू बी केयरफुल अबाउट दैट ठीक है अच्छा खैर सेकंड टाइप क्वेश्चन सेकंड टाइप क्वेश्चन में ना इक्विलिब्रियम के मोल्स टेबल वही है सब कुछ वही है पार्ट दे दे हैव नॉट गिवन यू द इक्विलिब्रियम मोल्स आई हैव नो आईडिया कि ये कितना है ये कितना है ये कितना है सो नथिंग इज गिवन नो इंफॉर्मेशन इज प्रोवाइडेड अब इसको पहले वाले क्वेश्चंस के साथ कंपेयर करो इट्स काइंड ऑफ द सेम लाइक इफ यू गो बैक तो इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी वर गिवन एक के मोल्स पता था हमें इक्विलिब्रियम के ऊपर ठीक है वी वर गिवन दिस एंड फ्रॉम दैट वी फिगर आउट कि भाई इसके 0.32 मस्ट हैव रिएक्टेड राइट सो वी गॉट दैट इंफॉर्मेशन नाउ वी डोंट हैव दैट इंफॉर्मेशन कि अगर मैं कूना के इफ आई गो बैक टू द क्वेश्चन एंड आई से के So if I go back to the question and I say, "Because I have no idea that the rest of the moles are, I don't know anything about equilibrium composition." So now the issue is that how much of CO two reacted? I mean, that's the question. Or maybe it got produced. I have no idea. Maybe we were initial to put CO two might be greater than 0.7 at equilibrium, or it might be less than 0.7. But I have no idea how much reacted. Or got produced, so I'm just going to assume K X reacted. Is that clear? Well, I'm do I'm doing exactly the same thing except that I don't know how much reacted. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Yes. ठीक है, मतलब पिछले केस में the only difference is in the last case I knew how much reacted, right? Or got produced. Now I don't know, so I'm just going to assume K X reacted. So if You started off with 0.7 moles and X of them reacted. So how many moles are you left with at equilibrium? 0.7 minus X, right? Yes. Clear? Acha, or it's one ratio yeah. one. So if X of these are reacting, so X of H2 would also react, right? So is the equilibrium for moles? How many? It's going to be 0.7 minus. X. X. But I'm I'm doing exactly the same thing, except I'm just using X now. Okay. पहले मैं I had a value. Now I don't have a value. अच्छा, and if X of this have reacted, तो वो आगे जाके produce कितना करेगा? मतलब it's one ratio one. If one reacts with one, produces one and one. So if X reacts, X reacts. तो आगे जाके how much would be produced? X is going to be produced, right? Is that clear? Yes. yes. Or x of the same ratio can the x of this would also be produced. So your equilibrium, equilibrium moles would be zero point three plus x, or it can be zero point three plus x, right? So is is this clear? I have done exactly the same thing. There's nothing different, except that I didn't know that how much how much how much of let's say CO two was reacting. So I just assumes x. Uh, sir. Yes. How do you know it's moving forward? By the way, I don't know. I'm just assuming K X reacted. Because oh, okay, okay. if it's not moving forward, so X का sign जब calculate करेंगे ना automatically change हो जाएगा. मतलब मतलब ये sign basically it's the sign right? Right now I'm assuming K equilibrium moles would be less than point seven right? Yes. My big assumption is that it's reacting or it's come or it's okay. So point seven minus six, right? But if it's if that's not the case, so when I do the calculation, the end result would be that the sine of x would automatically come out to be, 
I mean, it would make this minus sign positive. ठीक है. So, so now first thing, do I need to calculate concentration in this case or not, or should I use moles directly in the KC expression? It's one, so it's, it doesn't matter. I mean, it's got no units, right? Okay, it's two moles over here and two moles over here. So, product over reactant, karoge, so they'll all get cancelled out. So, I can use, I don't need to calculate uh, the concentration. Although it's given, it's they've given us that it's a 1 dm cube flask. Uh, no point dividing by 1 dm cube. So, what's the KC expression? It's CO concentration, which is 0 0.3 plus X into uh, H2O concentration. My other product, it's, it's, uh, it's this one, 0 0.3 plus X. And then it's going to be divided by my reactants, which are CO2 and H2. So it's 0.7 minus X into, into 0.7 minus X. And we know the value of KC, which is 1.44. Is that clear? So the final part yes. is the final part is easy. There's only one unknown, which is X. So all you have to do is you have to solve this. So what you can so all you have to do and solving this is kind of difficult. It's not that easy because uh, it's it's easy. It's not that difficult. But but the thing is, whenever you have a lot of calculations, where you have to do a lot of working to solve this, there's a lot of chances of making silly mistakes. So it's it's really hard to actually get the right answer. Okay. Although the calculation is pretty simple, if you if you know basic math, you should be able to do that. But remember this rule: ke, agar usme addition, subtraction, division, multiplication, ke jo wo hai na, bahut zada hai. Ke you have to do a lot of them. So the chances of error increases. The chances of you making silly mistakes increases. Achha, anyways, this is so I'm going to try and solve this. This is 0.3 plus x. Uh, the top thing is squared. The, the bo bottom thing is 0.7 minus x into 0.7 minus x. That's also squared. That's 1.44. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the under root. So if I take the under root, this is what I get. Is that clear? Yes. Yes. Whenever you take an under root, you get two values. You get a plus and you get a minus. So x is going to have two values. One of them has to be solved using what, plus 1.44 under root. The other one is going to be solved using minus 1.44 under root. So it's 0.3 plus x. It's called how can I'm taking it to the other side. So that's, uh, I'm taking plus 1.44 under root. So plus 1.44 under root into 0.7. And minus... 1.44 under root into x. Okay, 0.7 minus x into plus 1.44 under root. X key terms ko ikatha kar lo, so it's going to be it's going to be 1.44 under root x. Uh, plus I think x. Um, yahan pe no silly mistakes. Okay, you have to be very careful with this. Iske na sabse bada drawback hai ki everyone gets a gets a different answer. Or this side pick it's 1.44 under root in 2.7 and minus I think 0.3. Right? I say x ko common lelo or other divide kardo. So that's going to be 1.44 under root in 2.7. And that's going to get divided by what would it be? It would be You can run right? that's uh, uh, one plus one point four four under root, right? Yeah, yeah, no? yes, 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 that's that's all right. Just make sure I didn't make any mistakes, and then take it. So, remember, there's, there's a very bright chance of making a silly mistake here. I say, yeah, the point here. So, now there's a very bright chance of making a silly mistake on your calculator. Make sure you use brackets on your calculator, TK. Whenever you do complicated calculations, which are like, which have a lot of multiplication, make sure you put as many brackets. Tell the calculator clearly what you're trying to do. 
तो इस तरह करके सॉल्व करो और आंसर निकालो एंड वट्स दैट्स दैट्स द फर्स्ट वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स द सेकेंड वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स वुड बी वुड बी बिकॉज ऑफ माइनस वन पॉइंट फोर फोर हंड्रेड रूट तो एक्सप्रेशन वही रहने दो ओनली थिंग इज जस्ट चेंज इट टू माइनस वन पॉइंट फोर फोर हंड्रेड रूट सो इट्स कॉन्ट बी माइनस वन पॉइंट फोर फोर हंड्रेड रूट इन टू पॉइंट सेवन सो द सेकेंड एक्स वैल्यू वुड बी दिस और दैट वुड बी वन माइनस वन पॉइंट फोर फोर हंड्रेड रूट तो एक्सप्रेशन एक ही दफा बनाओ प्लस के लिए बना लो and for the minus 1 just change the 1.4400 root to a negative value so you get this expression so you without care what is the value that you're getting and it's going to be two values x1 x2 dono ka bata do kya aa raha hai ने किया क्या स्लेटर पे हमजा मुनीकाल आयशा आर यू डूइंग दिस सो द फर्स्ट वन इज गिविंग मी 0.62 ठीक है इज एनीवन एल्स गेटिंग अ डिफरेंट आंसर वो भी देख लेना द सेकंड वन आई गॉट 0.245 ठीक है सर सर सेम आई गॉट 0.245 बस ठीक है ये ये मैं बेसिकली पॉइंट आउट कर रहा था कि आई डोंट नो व्हाट द राइट आंसर इज ठीक है and it's it's simple math it's not that difficult theek hai but people will make a lot of silly mistakes here to ab ye mujhe nahi pata who made this silly mistake but you can double check this there was a two logon ka 0.245 aa gaya so i probably suspect you want to check the mark sheet uh for this one is 13 qp 23 just a second uh one second nine so is kya tha sorry S thirteen QP two three MS a concept part of this is. B. They're saying it's. I said, "Ek ne kaha hai point two five hai." We got point two five, right? Yes, sir. Yes. ठीक है, we got point two four, two five. One second. As I said, we we got point two five. And uh, as I said, also remember that okay, why did he? I just uh, why did why did he not say in the market scene point two four five? Why did he say point two five? Because I mean, earlier we pointed out that okay, why is he using point two five instead of point two four five? Remember. कि योर आंसर कैन नॉट बी मोर एक्ट दैन द सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर्स दैट आर गिवन ये है ना पॉइंट सेवन जीरो राइट यू डोंट नो व्हाट कम्स आफ्टर पॉइंट सेवन जीरो यू डोंट नो वेदर इट्स अ जीरो वेदर इट्स अ वन इज इट पॉइंट सेवन जीरो वन और इज इट सो थर्ड वाले के ऊपर ना द थर्ड सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर इज अनसर्टन मतलब यू डोंट नो वट पॉइंट सेवन जीरो नाइन है या पॉइंट जीरो सेवन जीरो फोर है और इज इट पॉइंट सेवन जीरो जीरो यू डोंट नो वट द थर्ड सिग्निफिकेंट फिगर इज So uncertainty is on the third significant figure. So, so when you get your answer, you can't be certain about the third significant figure. So, आप इसको हमेशा round कर दोगे. Your answer, just remember, your answer cannot be cannot have a more uh, have a higher accuracy than the values from which you calculated it. So, इसको point two five कर दोगे. Sir. Yes. What is the second answer? X two. वो उधर तो नहीं दिया हुआ. लेकिन what is the second answer? Did you calculate this? I I don't think they gave this here. The second one. I got five point seven. As I said, you got five point seven. I said now the last point. So you're getting two values of x. So why did he choose point two five? I said the reason he chose point two five is. ये जो equilibrium के moles है ना ये वाले. 
these ones. Moles can never have a negative value. I mean, it's when you're counting something, it doesn't make sense. Like if you if you have a basket full of apples, you're never going to have minus two apples. I mean, that doesn't make sense. So the minimum moles that you have for any substance should be zero. So this value it should not come out to be negative. So if 5.7 log, so this would come out to be negative. You'll get negative moles. So, so you're not supposed to get negative moles. So which is why you have to reject one value. You have to you have to plug in these values. Because remember, this thing we figure out this thing. The equilibrium moles. That's that's what the question wanted. So your equilibrium moles can never be negative. So remove that value, which is giving neg negative moles for equilibrium. Is that clear? Yes. Yes, sir. X key value negative ho sakti hai. X key value kuch bhi ho sakti hai. Lekin when you plug those X values into this thing, this should not come out to be negative. So they cannot be negative. I so said, is that is that clear? And also remember, you have to be very careful when you do this math. So this time, you know, all questions, what side questions on this time? For example, this is exactly the same, except to uh, expect, let's say, okay, th these are your initial moles. So I don't know how many reactors. So I'm going to assume K X reacted, right? I said, a chi chi zeke asan on your questions, QK. Uh, they'll only use simple equations because they've only asked you to solve quadratic equations. So the only way you can get a quadratic, because if there's three, here, then three CO2. So that would be an equation that would be that. I mean, you would have to find that would be a cubic equation. So that's not in your course. This is because this type of question is every time it's going to be a very simple question and almost the same type of question. So if you're reacting this, then it's one ratio one. So this one would X reacted, right? Or it's what everything is one ratio one to aage ja ke X produce honge. Or usse aage bhi kya hoga? X produced, right? So equilibrium moles kya honge? This would be 0 0.4 minus X. And this would be 0 0.4 minus X. This would be 0 0.2 plus X. And this would be 0 0.2 uh, plus x. Or if you put the expression report, karlo, that's going to be. Uh, again, usne, he did give us the volume 1 dm cube, but it was not needed because the unit would get cancelled out. So you can just use moles directly. So it's going to be 0 0.2 plus x squared. Well, 0 0.2 plus x into 0 0.2 plus x. So this into this squared. And divide by the reactant, which is 0 0.4 minus 6, and that's going to be squared as well, right? But KC value is 1100 Kelvins, right? He gave us it 6.4 times 10 power minus 1. So that is provided. I say, it's come a screenshot, take a page. Jovio is going to try it and answer when it's, a, it's, a, it's simple math. I said, remember. Make sure you take the square root. That would be the easiest way to solve this. But when you have under root, remember this would give you two values, plus and minus. So, solve karne ke lena, make sure you take the under root. So, I'm going to snapshot. Try and find the answer to this one. Which x x ki do values are there? There's going to be x1 and there's going to be x2. The equilibrium moles should not come out to be negative. So reject that X value. Just pay equilibrium moles when they come out to be negative. Okay, let's reject it. Okay, let's try to keep your questions. Okay, this is clear. Yes, sir. 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 Y